Good afternoon. My name is Don Hadley. I'm president of Applied Vision Works. And I wanted to follow up on the Waffle House at 3 a.m. video. And the reason I wanted to follow up on it, got a lot of fascinating response. And I think basically there was a lot of agreement that that's kind of the attitude we're looking for, the ability, the capabilities, especially the higher up somebody moves in an organization or the more client-facing customer facing the employee or the position is. Um, I want to talk about, related to that, what we call the Babe Ruth mindset. Um, I had an interaction recently where somebody was trying to get a result in a project. They said, well, but we have to keep in mind that blah, blah, blah. And they told me how bad the project had gone um, six months ago. And so they were, it's like they were setting expectations. And so I asked the question, do you know who Babe Ruth is? And said, yes. Um, out of curiosity, what do you think Babe Ruth did when, you know, Babe Ruth went up the plate to hit the ball? Did he think about, you know, what do you think he thought about? And uh, they said, well, I, I want to hit a home run. I want to do well, blah, blah, blah. And I said, well, that's exactly the mindset. I said, did they go back to the dugout before they got up to the plate and said, hey, guys, look, last couple times I struck out. I'm going to try not to strike out this time, you know not sure what's going to work out, but we just got to be ready because I, I just, I don't know. Is is that what he did? And, and the guy was talking to him, he said, well, no. And I said, well, but that's what you're doing. You're, you're, you're telling us you're setting the bar low. Instead of getting up to the plate and focusing on what's most important, how you're gripping the bat, how the pitcher's looking, how the pitcher's holding the ball, your, your feet in the batter's box. If you're not paying attention to that, uh, and have some belief and excitement and confidence that, hey, I'm gonna go hit the ball in the park. I'm gonna do everything I can. I can't wait to see what happens. That passion, that excitement is a whole different ball game than trying not to fail. And what I'm hearing from you right now is you're trying not to fail. Do you think Babe Ruth would have been as successful if he simply tried not to fail? And the guy said, hey, I got it. Let me go at this differently and he went at it differently and it made a huge difference and it made a difference not just in terms of his performance but as he communicated with the teams and the people around them it made a huge difference to them and got everybody thinking about how do we make and get the best result from it not just how do we get what we expected but how do we knock the ball out of the park and it made it a lot more fun for the team so i wanted to share this with you because i see right now too much you know, trying not to fail, or oh, I hope it works, or let's try this, or it's a very lukewarm at best response to things when, to me, every interaction is an opportunity to learn something, to make a difference, to knock the ball out of the park, to become better myself, help better other people. And if we don't take that approach, we're not going to do very well. So if you have any questions, thoughts on this, my email is dhadley at appliedvisionworks.com. My cell phone is 919. 368-9008.